The sun sets over the hidden leaf village, casting long shadows over the training ground where two figures stand facing each other. One is Barack Obama, his eyes gleaming with determination and a hint of a smile on his face. The other is Joe Biden, his gaze equally resolute, his stance steady and unwavering. Obama is the first to move. His hands weave through the air, forming the intricate signs of the Raisingan. Obama Raisingan, he shouts, as a swirling ball of chakra forms in his hand. It's a powerful attack, one that he has mastered over years of rigorous training. He charges at Biden, the Raisingan whirling in his hand like a miniature tornado. But Biden doesn't flinch. He stands his ground, waiting for the right moment. Just as Obama is about to strike, Biden's eyes flash. Biden Jutsu, he exclaims. Suddenly, the world around Obama shifts. He's no longer in the hidden leaf village, but in a world of illusions, a perfect copy of the Jinjutsu. In this illusionary world, Biden attacks from all sides. His strikes come from nowhere and everywhere at once, a relentless barrage that leaves Obama no room to breathe. But Obama is not defeated so easily. With a shout, he dispels the Jinjutsu, his Raisingan bursting forth with renewed vigor. The two continue their battle, their attacks lighting up the night sky. The Obama Raisingan and the Biden Jutsu clash again and again, creating shockwaves that ripple through the air. Neither gives an inch. It's a battle of wills, a test of their resolve. They push each other to their limits, their chakra levels dwindling with each attack. But neither is willing to back down. They fight on, their movements becoming a blur of speed and power. Finally, they stand panting, their chakra nearly depleted. They share a nod of respect, acknowledging each other's strength. The fight is over, but their friendship remains, stronger than any jutsu. As the dust settles, they look at each other, their eyes reflecting the bond forged in the heat of battle. They know that they have given it their all, that they have pushed each other to their limits. And in the end, that's what matters most.